Hello again everyone and welcome back to The Witcher 3. We're here in Skellige as always. Uh, not for too much longer of course as always, but um, still. Uh, so we need to go and collect our reward now from the missing miners, uh, which we did um, conclude in the last episode where we did kill the, uh, the, the rock troll. Uh, very unfortunate end for the uh, for the miners, but uh, yeah, I mean, it, th there's 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 probably a way of looking at it to say that they did that they did kind of have it coming, that the, that the troll did kind of warn them to um, to to leave his cave, but at the same time, I don't necessarily think rock trolls have rightful claim to the natural resources of the world, if you know what I mean. There, There's many things um, in that cave which, you know, were natural. Rock trolls are natural, let's be honest. I'm not saying that humans deserve, deserve, deserve all of that either, but, you know. But we'll get our reward regardless. I'm sure, uh, I'm pretty sure it was a decent sum of money. Yeah. Greetings, Watcher. Greetings, Gya. Found your miners. They went in a troll's cave and started mining while the troll was home. Didn't take any. No. Troll won't be any more trouble, though. Small comfort. Still earned my reward. That you did. Yeah, here. Safe journey to you. Sorry for your loss. 200, 200 experience for that. Well, wow. and, and 305 crowns as well to boot. Happy days indeed. Um, okay. So, what else have we got here to do, left here to do on uh, Scaliger? Um, no more of that. Witcher contracts we've got. We've got, we got a dragon and Scaliger's most wanted. Uh, and then there's some treasure hunts as well. Um... I think I ever used to get ever get used to that choir just popping up out of nowhere. Okay, so I was politely informed that just north of Sund, um, there's this um, little island here, the with the treasure. Apparently, to the east of that of said island, one of these, I think. Um, something changed on one of these islands since King's Gambit. So I'm going to go to Sund and I'm going to see what we can find there before we do pursue the other two contracts that we have in our possession right now. Uh, so I'm quite curious just to see what's down there actually. So we'll use our fast travel. We'll go to Sund. Which is all the way down here. It's not even that far away, really. Uh, I've got a sun. <clears throat> actually, looking at it, it might be tricky to access. I think actually we're going to go to Ranveig. Go to Ranveig, we'll take the boat. I think we've done just about enough sailing for adventure seeker for uh, a whole game's worth since uh, since that, but if we take the ball, like I say, I think it'll be easy to access, because it, it looks like it's on the bottom of a hill or a mountain. And if I go from Sund, uh, chances are I'll probably try and go down said mountain and probably kill myself. So, also the boat doesn't seem to want to go forward. Is it... I don't know what it's hitting, but there's something in the water which doesn't want to let me go forward. But, oh god, and again... It must be like a log, like a log that's underneath the water or something, but yeah. I'm pretty sure it's not that island there. I'm almost certain it's not that one. Pretty sure it ain't. But, um. Right, yeah. Let's, uh. Let's head over in this direction. Something that, something's dead over there. We'll head over in this direction and see what we can find on that little island group. Uh. I am expecting big things, for sure. Despite the island group definitely not looking that big at all. If we look at it from here... Yeah, 
Yeah, literally just 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 around here it should be apparently. Um It's a bunch of echidnas, so we'll We'll shoot that we'll shoot these down so our uh, exploration is a little bit easier. Get off the board. Anyone else? I can probably just get up the here. Oh no, hang on. I was hoping I could get off the boat, unfortunately, can't. Nope. Absolutely not. Right, are we good? Is that a kid they're gonna come down and try and swoop? Oh! Burn a brand. Horrific death. Jesus, they weren't lying about um, tying her up and letting the birds go to. Oh. Oh, God. That is. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, she did kind of deserve it with what she did. She did. She was responsible for a lot of people's death. So, like I say, I'm, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not gonna say that 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 that, that she wasn't worthy of a somewhat brutal death. Her son, I did feel sorry for because he he was on the side of good, but <sighs> yeah, right. Um, let's try and do Skelliger's most wanted then. Uh, where are we going for this one? So it's the attack site using on Witcher senses. Let me just. So during his time, the village of Fires, Dolgara learned of a contract that a monster said to have attacked a merchant in his car. The merchant in question was very insistent that a Witcher investigate this matter and kill the beast. So that is. I guess it's just a bit north of Firesdoll. So if we travel to Firesdoll, we cannot perform that action. Why? Is it because I was in combat in floating quotation marks? I do the foot. I, I do the floating quotation marks, but I am currently holding a controller. I drop it on the floor. Uh, so why? Why can I not? Uh, any reason why I can't? I just don't. There we go. Yes, yeah, so a burner. That they they weren't lying about about her death. I did. I didn't actually expect to see her corpse, a, a, a corpse anywhere, or her again, but. Yep, they found her, alright. And again, do you think it was somewhat deserved? Because by Skelliger's traditions, which I don't always agree with to be fair, but by Skelliger's traditions, she should have been the one who actually went, who actually sailed away with um, the, the, the uh, with, uh, uh, with the old king. Let's go. And she refused, didn't she? And it was, um, was it a daughter that went instead? I'm not 100% sure. But yeah, so she kind of... Uh, Betrayed many traditions of Skelliger even before what she did. All right, let's uh, let's uh, search search this site then. Let's see what we can uh, discover about this attack. Must be the comrade of the fellow from Pharaoh. Hmm, odd. Looks like he died of old age, not because a necker ripped him apart. That's unusual. What about this blood, this horse blood. like claw marks in its flanks, but it's also got lockjaw and a warped spine, like it might have died of tetanus. What the hell's happened to this? The, these guys then. So their deaths don't necessarily correlate with, with, a, with a proper attack. Oh no. Wait, Geralt. Geralt. Move. Jesus Christ. That was close. Who did that? Something tells me that was no accident. Better investigate. Yeah, that seems like a coincidence, does it does it not? 
a boulder falls the at the exact same time when, when Geralt's investigating. Furrow looks fresh. Boulder must have rolled through here. Yeah, so it's up there. So we just need to find a way around and up this hill. Here we go. So the boulder definitely started here. Boulder started here. I think I see some tracks. All right, what pushed the boulder then? Follow the monster's tracks. Necker tracks. Clear prints. A neck is that intelligent? That they would like try and lay a trap like that? Maybe they are. Maybe I'm not giving them enough credit. It's a, it's weird to think that, but it's a possibility, I guess. There definitely seems to be a horde of something up ahead, but that might they might be wolves actually. I think they are wolves. We'll go and cleanse this wolf population. Well, we'll cleanse the wolf population if we don't get up in its bit out first. There we go. Anyway, where were we? Monster tracks. Aha, cave. Is it a prominent necker? Is it a single? Oh god! What's going on? What here? the hell is this thing doing? This is way too intelligent for your standard necker. Has to be, doesn't it? I'm definitely going to save the game here in case this goes Pete Tong, which it might well do. Just going to keep it slow. I don't really know what I'm walking into. Indragas, okay, that's not what I expected. Put Neridan down, that should slow that should slow okay, even even slow down the Indragas are fucking brutal. They re oh my god! Right, we need to get something else on the go here. Igni. Oh my lord. The oil that I've got on my sword doesn't really help us in this instance. Luckily they're, luckily they're not doing too much damage, they just really hit a lot. That should get him, there we go. Oh nice! All of and Drago workers now. Do we bust the whirl out? Bust out the whirl. That seems to work quite well. Ow. Arrakis now, what the hell? I don't like that big boulder thing on its back. I, I can't remember what it does, but either way, I don't like it. Axie, maybe? Oh, that's an ad, but still, it, it, it did the job. Are we quite done with this over the top ambush, or is there any more for us to, to deal with? Because again, I'm very suspicious about this fact. Just, just seems to be a lot, you know. So the tracks go up here, I think. I thought, I thought this was the way we came in. To be fair, but it's not. Drink a bit of water. Anything in this side room? Even if we add these, no, there's, there's nothing here. I don't think. Nothing too exciting. A necker's foot hollowed out inside like a boot. Someone lost it while running. Oh! The plot thickens. It's not a necker. Someone was wearing that. As disgusting as that is. Necker paw and a human foot. Small like a child's. Clearly running. Like a child's? Oh, we're not dealing with a kid here, are we? It can't be just an innocent child, no way. No way. I'm heading into some kind of structure now, which makes this even stranger. There are necker corpses everywhere now. Is this some weird research? Trail in 
things here. <laughs> Who would think to hang drawings in a place like this? Oh, look at that. Someone actually planned like planned for this. A child, or someone who's damned clumsy with a quill. Huh. Two sticks protruding above the shoulder. Think that might be me. Indeed, it is. Looks is a bit like Marilyn Manson, wagon? but. And here's where that boulder almost crushed me. Well, whoever's done this, their plan's been foiled for sure. Necker tracks near the boulder. Now I know where they came from. Just wonder who actually left them. These balls on sticks are Endrigas. Guess they were supposed to finish me off. All in all, a pretty elaborate plan. And I say it's definitely the work. It's definitely not the work of some and this must normal be the child. Place. Huh. Looks like this whole ambush was a group effort. High time I met the pranksters. Go to the conspirators' meeting spot at night. A necker. Okay then. Torn apart by something huge. Then Very interesting cut its indeed. Legs off. This is an elaborate thing, isn't it? Very elaborate indeed. You've almost got to respect the ingenuity, don't you? Almost. Not quite. Ah, oh, look, neckers. More neckers. We should be able to tear these guys up pretty easily. They're on level 12. They're pretty much running to falling on my sword here. There we go. Right, I think it's going to be too early for us to... Um actually see actually catch the conspirators out but we shall go there regardless seems to be on top of this big hill so why exactly would they go to this let to this like length as well to, to try and take Geralt out is there some grudge here or it's we it's a weird situation So that, so this is the meeting spot, very clearly. So unfortunately, it's a bit too early or late, depending on how you look at it. Um, if we wait here, we we'll meditate here until about 6 p.m. Maybe might it might that might be too early to be honest. I'm not too sure. I think it probably is going to be too early, you know. Uh, yeah, there's nobody there. Um, wait until, na until 9 p.m. We can't do that now. Oh, is it because I was mid-fall animation? There we go. Right, 9 p.m. This will hopefully be... There we go. We got it. Must be the place. Alright then. Show your faces. Where are you? You can come out. I've seen your plan. Who's Besides, had it in for girls? I can hear you. One of you's wheezing like a broken bellows. Yeah. <laughs> Another's panting frantically like a deer caught in a trap. And the third should really take something for that throat. I'd try time extract. Oh my god, what? Oh, it's a godling. A godling, a troll, and a man. What's going on? Someone care to explain what's going on here? What's going on is that you're down there, and we're up here. That's a situation I can fix quickly. Richy thingy no dum dum. Oh, bounding witchy thingy swoop man. That's right. We've caught you. You're at our mercy now, and we're none too merciful. A skeleton godling. That's oh, really? not, not what I expected to see. That is, I could just turn around. Hold it down. Glitchy thingy, gum gum shucky, <laughs> well, swoop man. I wonder why he's not already in that. Oh, so there's a wolf as werewolf as well. What you the hell? Want to kill him. <sighs> what? We never said nothing about killing. Not a thing. We were just supposed to scare him. So witchy thingy, us scary thingies. Make him no touch us. I believe you misunderstood. <sighs> He's a murderer, like the rest of them. 
like the one who killed my Adalia. <sighs> what the? F Awful sorry about your wench. We all are. A doubler. But this witch. Ah, uh, right. Him, and we can't very well punish him for another's crime. He has much to answer for, too. <sighs> I heard he killed a Corrid in Tucson. But Tucson. the golden dragon. So what? What about Verena? The Bruxa with the fondness for blue roses from the Zair. He showed her no mercy. <sighs> ah, so these are all people that we, that we found in the, uh, well, some of them. Appear, appear monsters we found in previous games, like Varina, I think it was was one, and the Golden Dragon must have been um, it's a synthesis, right? I think. Uh, right, I've helped monsters on many occasions. Varina yeah. killed many an innocent. I had to do something, but I've helped monsters aplenty. Yes. Who? Oh, see, look at all these. I helped a godling. I helped a godling. Two, in fact. Johnny and Sarah. That's true. I heard about that. Don't make me laugh. That's not nearly enough. <sighs> I let Salma go, yep. Salma, a succubus in Novigrad. Let her go free, even though I knew she'd killed some guardsmen. You mean, even when you know a monster's killed someone? You don't hurt them? If Not always. Reason, yeah. Yeah. Sometimes. You see? He's not that bad. We should let him go. Let him go? No. So he can track us down and butcher us. I won't hurt you. I don't kill sentient creatures. You lie. Every witcher is a murderer. <sighs> That's I kill just monsters, discrimination. True. It's my job. But only when they threaten humans. You hate us! Hate us all! Humans hate you all. Because they don't know you. Don't know which of you are dangerous and which want to live in peace. Only witchers stand between you and humans. We know both worlds. Protect both. We kill dangerous monsters so the thinking ones can live in peace. So you see now, as you stand there, scared. You know we have the upper hand. Ah, I wouldn't count your lucky stars, my good man. Could have killed you all long ago if I'd wanted to. I believe him. Oh, we should let him be. I'm all for it. Listen to the goblin. thinking, he's telling the truth. Let witchy thingy go. Well, it's three to one at least. Fools, gullible newborns. A just witcher. A kind witcher. A lying witcher. He fiends and all. All humans lie. Let it rest. This is not the way. You shan't bring Adalia back. Ah, stay here. I'll finish this alone. <sighs> so you want to find me? Well... If you're sure about it, you're making a mistake. One last chance. No, you're gonna find me. Very well. You can see why this is called Skelliger's Most Wanted now. Goodbye. What a waste. You were right. Monsters are like men. Some are good, some are bad, and still others simply lost. That's a right shame. I was different once. Should never have let him talk us into this. Here, a little something from us. So you'll remember not all monsters are dangerous. Thanks. Thank you. Now go on. Live your lives in peace, and don't try any more pranks, please. There you go, then. Necker high boots. Wow, we, we, we actually got the shoes. What are they like, our curiosity? They're actually really good. 
They are, they are medium armor. What's the ones we have on now? Light armor. Yeah, I, I'm gonna stick to light armor, but they, but they, they are a really nice set of boots, actually. Well worth the reward, for sure. Um, wow. That, that was a really cool quest, actually. You kind of... Um, got the chance to sort of show your allegiance to, to, to both sides of the coin there. That was, yeah, that was, that, that was, that was interesting. I, I don't remember a character called the Dahlia, like, whether she was in one of the older games or something that we are, we've already, already done this one, but it, 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 it was, it did seem anger at another Witcher, I just don't know which one. Um, so yeah, I, I probably just missed the ball on that one. But yeah, that was a really interesting quest, actually, I really, really enjoyed that one. Uh, and I'm glad that we talked most of them down at the very least. Uh, so yeah. I think on that note, guys, we're going to end this episode here. Next episode, we shall um, find our next contract to do. And, yeah, I hope you all have a, have a wonderful day, guys. Bye-bye.